Investigating a deadly car crash overnight. A woman is dead and the man believed to be at fault is in the hospital. Two News reporter Patricia Santos is live on the corner of 81st and New Sepulpa Road with more from witnesses who ran in to help. Patty? Well, those witnesses tell us this road here is known for its deadly wrecks. And yesterday, last night, they got to see it for themselves. Take a look. Witnesses tell Sepulpa Police the driver of this Honda ran a red light. He T-boned the driver of a Toyota and pushed the car into a ditch. Now, the impact uh, was on the driver's side. It killed the driver, a woman in her late 20s. Now, a witness told police she saw the crash and ran to help the victims. The car, the one I was attending, began to fill with smoke. So I opened the door the best of my ability and pulled him out sideways and assisted him to the side of the road and laid him down. Now, police arrived seconds later. The driver was taken to the hospital with internal bleeding. He underwent surgery last night. Now, this is the third fatal wreck in the Tulsa metro area in less than 24 hours. Yesterday, a U.S. postal worker was killed in a four car crash. And uh, later in the day, another woman was killed when she was ejected when her car flipped. Live in Sepulpa, Patricia Santos, 2 News works for you.